Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to replace the aperture flex cable of a Sigma 17 to 35 mm lens after it has been disassembled. Recently I had this lens with aperture problems. The aperture did not work and it was caused by a faulty flex cable. So I had to disassemble the lens, replace the flex cable with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to replace the aperture flex cable. This video is part of video series about repairing the Sigma 17 to 35 mm lens. In the first video I showed you how to disassemble the lens. And this second video is about replacing the flex cable with a new one. And then in the third video I show you how to assemble the lens. If you're interested in the other two videos, then the links are here or down in the description below. Before I would start, let me talk about the tools that I will use to replace the flex cable with a new one. I will use a PH30 screwdriver, a metal tweezers, an adjustable tweezers, a soldering gun, a soldering iron and a desoldering pump. And of course I will need a new flex cable. If you are interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it, share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So let's get started. This is the aperture unit. We will replace the old cable with this new one. Remove the screw from the cable holder. Cut off the end of the cable and next to the motor. Remove the two screws, then remove the motor. Use a soldering gun and the soldering pump to remove the soldering iron from the cable. Remove the remains of the cable. Remove the soldering iron from the other parts of the cable also.
Remove the remains of the flex cable. Connect the new flex cable to the motor. Use an adjustable metal tweezers to hold the cable in its place. Put back the two small screws which are holding the motor. Put back the flex cable to its place. Put back the screw to the holder of the cable. Solder the cable to the aperture unit. We are done with replacing the aperture cable. In the next video I show you how to assemble the lens. Link is in the upper right hand corner or in the description below. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it Share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. Links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. See you next time in another video.